The following unofficial rebroadcast of Twit Live is brought to you by Odd TV and Cashfly. Cashfly's global network delivers your content, ensuring your website, streaming media, and downloads exceed expectations at cashfly.com. No, not just today. Oh my God. Wait till you hear this. <laughs> this Week in Tech is brought to you by and by audible.com. Sign up for the Platinum Plan and get two free books. Go to audible.com slash twit2 and follow Audible on Twitter. User ID audible underscore com. <laughs> oh, no, that's going to be right at the beginning? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh, my God. Oh. Uh, well, if you insist. <laughs> oh, my God. That is so funny. <laughs> All right, let's get a fire Little extinguisher. Little they know. Now, okay, the fire extinguisher is right there. All right. Oh let, me, let me just save this out because Tony's got to uh, get it. Should I move back from, it up on I'm carbonite? Exit from this area less some sort of. Yeah, let's back this up on carbonite in case there's a. <laughs> we need an off site. <laughs> you know, we get. Why don't you do a take just in case? Welcome to the final episode of Twits. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, a horrible accident destroyed the entire Twit cottage and all its inhabitants today. Except for Roger. Roger, who ran out the door before the fire eating began. All right, so you got the goods there. So talk a little bit about. I'll explain. I'll demo once, and then I'll explain the theory. You're going to do it with a dry torch a couple of times, just to make sure. We're you not going to be a YouTube video, are we? Unlike what went wrong. Yeah. <laughs> It'll be flaming shots. It'll be those two two idiots, those, and then Leo. Those morons. There you go. This right, is this right. is for you, bud. Okay, hold Should on. Should I? Like move my computer. She's scared. Yeah. You know, this, okay, now wait a minute. Let's look at this. This you get these in the store. This is a, a marshmallow cooker. Uh, no, yeah, this is one of those big. You can get them at, at Walmart. They're one of those big yeah. forked. Uh, stick a weenie on there and, and roast them. Okay, and so Colleen's getting the YouTube camera ready. Um, on the inside. Well, I'll keep telling. Yeah, keep talking. We, we don't want the exact instructions on YouTube. But uh, underneath here, if you look, you can almost see where I've kind of hammered it into a crook, like a big uh, yeah, a circle. To and hold the wad. That's 100% uh, cotton T-shirt material okay, in there. Okay, Jersey cotton. Yeah. And you've soaked this in uh, white gas. I soaked mine in, in actually lighter fluid because we didn't have any white gas. It didn't stop by. But li Oh, no, you're fluid. not going to do lighter fluid, are you? Well, lighter fluid actually is harder to burn than white gas. Uh, white gas oh, He's going to do the safe one. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Yeah. Oh, good. White gas has I'm a flash so point happy, Brian, about that, zero degrees. that you shared with me, and then I have the white gas. All right, and so basically what you're going to do, and you know what? I know it's warm in here, but we really ought to close that because you don't want that draft. That wind is the is the enemy of the fire eater. The wind, wind, that's good. Wind is the uh, Just close the whole thing. I uh, should move. Yeah, you don't have to be out. here. You don't have to be here, Well, you'll Sarah. be, you'll be, what you'll notice. Okay, we already talked Can, about now, thermal lag. Before we do this, I, I want you to get uh, camera two, the wide angle, a little bit tighter on me and Brian. So, and get that chair out of there because we want to make sure we record this in uh, in every way possible. Because <laughs> if this is my last show, I just want to <laughs> make sure there's there's a record there's a record of it. I, I guess you can't go wider. You're just gonna have to go the way you go. That's good. All right, uh, here, go, yeah, go ahead and shut that all the way. And then that way we don't have anything to worry you close about. Close the window. All right, oh, so Jesus. when oh, you God. Right, take all a right. look at this though. Take okay, a look at this. I'm watching. Now. When you when you light the torch, notice that the, the flame goes straight up. Yep. Right? And if you put your fingers to each side, you don't feel a lot of it's heat not hot. at all. Right? Okay. Because because again, it's like the, the heat goes straight up. That's okay. the two things you gotta remember. Heat's going heat up. Heat goes up and exhale. If you inhale, that's the only way you can screw this up. If you okay. inhale, you will die. You'll breathe in flame. Right. And okay. that's two thousand degrees Fahrenheit and that'll not oh, be good Jesus. on the uh, yeah. Okay. But exhale, exhale. It's not too late to, to, to change my mind. Here are the moves you're going to do. Okay. You ready? Yeah. So first of all, you're going to get to where you're pointing straight up at the ceiling, your mouth, and, and you, you want your nose pointing straight up at the ceiling. Okay. You're going to stick out your tongue all the way, all uh -huh. the way, ah, uh, like that. Uh. You're going to land it on your tongue like a landing pad, ah, uh. uh. and then using your tongue you're, like, a, like a grip, you're going to pull it down in your mouth and close your mouth around, around that metal rod like this. So it goes like, ah, uh, ah, uh, oh. Like that. Okay, so there's a two-step thing. Right. Should I practice that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tongue out. But, but I'm not supposed to inhale the uh, air. You're going to be exhaling slowly, you, and, and you never want to get – this is the, other, the only other tip is never let your breath get below 50% because you don't want to be in a position where you've run out of air and you instinctively go <gasps> – Yeah, yeah, yeah. No gasping a lot. Right, so, so, but, but you're an audio guy. You can exhale slowly. So, so, so you don't have to exhale fast. It's no, not, no, very it's just, slow. So you don't very inhale, basically. Here, watch how slow. Like, go. 
I mean, it's on my oh, tongue. Oh, you can touch your time. tongue. Yeah, you want it to touch your tongue. So you're going to land it on the tongue and then all the way closed. Just like that. Okay. All right, do it That's again. Easy. Do it again. Do it again. All right. So I'm breathing out. Slowly. Land it. Close it. There you go. Easy. That's it. And in I'm fact, we'll start, we'll start you with a baby flame. Baby flame? Do I get a baby? What's yeah. a baby flame? Well, here, I mean, uh, yeah, like, uh, Oh, he's breathing fire. Yeah, that's that's the advanced version. We're not going to do that. But uh, here, let, let let me get you just a little bit. Okay, get 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 that get the juice on there. Just the tip. It's a, <laughs> I love that you have no fear about this. Well, what is the what's the, what could go wrong? What could go wrong? <laughs> All right, now I'm going to tell you one thing. You do not want to uh, you do not want to wait at all because the longer the mean, longer it burns, the more that rod heats up. Oh yeah, yeah. hot rod's wanna, bad. Right, you want to close your hot mouth all the way bad. around that rod. Okay, right. Okay. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna I'm gonna reach forward gonna and touch, light it. Let's rehearse it without the flame. There you go, like okay. this. Okay. Don't the way get back, in front of the camera too. And go ahead and have it like right here. Okay. So that you don't have far to go, and in fact choke up on it so that you're not. There you go. So you got better. There you go. Okay. Like this, and then tongue out. <laughs> What's that? Ah, that's the smoke alarm. <laughs> well, Blow on it. Well, why do we have a smoke alarm in here? What Blow the hell is it. that all about? I didn't even know we had such Blow a Blow on it with your breath. It'll go out. <laughs> Colleen's just going to take here, it out. Here, hand that to me. Just take it out of here. Here, Colleen. Blow yeah. on it with your okay, breath. Okay, you got to clear it Yeah, whenever okay. you do, yeah, there you just go. Just blow on it. <laughs> this is she took the bat. Or take the battery out because there won't be. Hey, where's the fire extinguisher? Yeah, we got it. Here. Okay. Well, I will have it in my hands. Okay. Actually, let me get so somebody this, else to take So if my head is engulfed in flames, your instruction is to spray the hell out of me. <laughs> okay? Just spray the hell out of me. Okay, okay. Colleen's going to take it over now. Okay. okay. So, again, you want to be already choked up, tongue okay. out, okay. facing straight up. Land it. Oh, I've choked up. Yeah, Wait a uh, not, not that much. <laughs> <That's>, <laughs> maybe we'll have trouble here. Okay. All, right. Okay. All right. Tongue out. Land it. Close it. And, and now when you close it... That tastes terrible. It does taste terrible. And you haven't even gotten the fuel. Oh, no, you did get the fuel. I got the fuel, baby. But when you close it, hold it for a good three seconds because otherwise put it out. you're going to do this. You're going to do it. You're going to go. We don't want a premature outage. Okay. See, like that. So you yeah, want yeah. to leave it open. But it won't be hot. Uh, no, you will It'll not be feel warm. the heat. You okay. will, yeah, you'll barely feel the warmth. So okay. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it right away after you uh, tell as me what you do. As soon as I light it, tongue out. There you go. So you're, you're going to be in that position like you're ready to go. Yep. I'm going to light it, and you're going to do immediately that. No hesitation. You'll be fine. That's nah, no problem. You ready? Yeah. All right, ready? Yep. Here we go. Do it. Yeah! <laughs> I didn't. Wait a minute. You have to do it again because I didn't have the camera on me. Let's go. <laughs> I have to have a tight. I have to have the tight shot. Wait a minute. Let's get it in the camera. See, now okay. you're an old pro. Now you're showing off. Yeah, <laughs> it's easy. I got an Emmy for that. <laughs> Just right beneath the Emmy. That'll be good. All right, you ready? Yeah. All right, here we go. Do it again. Hey. That's it. That's Nicely easy. Done. What's so hard about fire eating? Fire eating. Now I'm watching it on the replay. Here it now, is. Now, can I put a nail in my nose now? Yeah, no, we, I brought the nails, actually. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> that actually scares me more than eating fire. I understand that. Look at Look that. At Everybody's freaking out on there. That's awesome. It wasn't that, wasn't that hard. It was good. And it actually doesn't even taste bad. No, and it, it's... Uh, you don't get that much fluid in your, uh, in your mouth. Right. No, well, you don't notice it now, but you'll notice like an hour from now you'll belch and you'll be like, what is... Ooh, that's fuel. <laughs> what was that? That that's was fuel. disgusting. That's disgusting. I'm eating sterno. <laughs> no, I'm used to that, actually. There's like a four to one ratio row. of that was awesome to one guy being like, big whoop. <laughs> so what? <laughs> he ate some fire. Big deal. Whatever. Any idiot can do that. <laughs> he thinks he's so smart. Twitter. Twitter. I said it. Twitter. <laughs> well played, though. Good job, Leo. <laughs> hey, Congrats thank you. Uh, that was fun. Thank you, Brian. Yeah, you got it. Man. That's I'm really fun. You for it. Oh, you know, I, it wasn't that scary. It's like it a success fun. seminar. Now you could do anything. You've eaten fire. You know, I would not walk on coals. Is that the same kind of thing? Same kind of thing. Uh, you, you know, there is a skeptic convention, and a guy told the story. There was one of these guys who swears that it's supernatural, that he could walk oh, on coals. Oh, that's BS. Right. And so, and so they're like, oh, really? Would you mind doing it on national TV? And they made like a football field length <laughs> <How fucking hell? laughs> of the fire okay, coals. And he just kept that. on going through it. And uh, the, one, the one thing that they held but off on. But you could keep doing it, right? Couldn't no, you? No. 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 You, you've only got Eventually so it heats the, therm up. the thermal lag catches up. It's uh, the same deal, right? It's thermal you, lag. Thermal lag. So eventually... By the way, they, the one thing they hedged on was they wanted to, as soon as, because the, they knew he'd get burned, and they were going to have two tents. One would be homeopathic healing, and one would be oh, West yeah. Which traditional one do you go medicine. To? Which, <laughs> uh, I think I'd like some homeopathy, please. 
Yeah, which one would you go to? Put some St. John's word uh, on it. Where's my chiropractor? Fine. I think my back is out. Um, that's cool, Brian. I think it's so cool that you, you, you do this stuff. Scam School is such a great show. Oh, I'm glad you it's did. It's really, it. really fun. Well, you, you know what? You make it. It's, it's more than just uh, tricks. It's, it's just it's entertainment. It's really entertainment. Well, I'm glad you see it that way because there's some yeah. people who I ask, I'm like, well, which of these have you tried? They're like, I haven't tried any of them. I just love watching the No, no, watching I, don't, the I don't do any of these tricks. Yeah. Are you kidding? How often do I hang out in bars? You know what I'm really excited about is uh, coming up soon, we're going to start showing some stuff. I, I gave a talk at South by Southwest called uh, Social Engineering, Scam Your Way Into Anything or From Anybody. And it was the first like hour-long talk I've ever written. And uh, apparently it was it was it did well. There was like 600 people there in attendance, wow. standing room only, and it's That's all the awesome. science about uh, about this kind of stuff. That's awesome. Well, th you see, you talk online. Everybody wants to know where they can see Brian talking about that stuff. Uh, the talk, the audio is online. We're going to make uh, oh, the good. video. The full presentation will be a couple It'll of scam school episodes. School? Right. Yeah, if you search on South by Southwest Interactive, and uh, I'm starting to do a. Uh, some online stuff. You know, the one thing I don't get on Scam School is that they're all heavily produced and they're all, uh, they're all. <laughs> That's not what you get here either. They, well, exactly. Well, but I'm jealous of it because it's this fun is to do real. It live. You get the, it, well, yeah. and so I've started. And if actually, I blew my head up. You would have seen it. Well, that's why I've started doing uh, these little goofy. I call them the BB Live Show. Just Brian Brushwood Live. It's if better you go to that way. BBLiveShow.com. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. In fact, we're doing a, a one-year anniversary of Scam School on Tuesday. Oh, fun. Which will be fun. We're going to play some. BB Live Show. BB Live Show. Dot com. Yeah. Uh, of course, uh, uh, Scam School is on revision three dot com slash Scam School. And when you're ever in town, in fact, even when you're not, we're gonna call you in, uh, in Austin. Well, I'm glad, I'm glad I made the cut because oh, look, made the I cut. understand, dude. Brad, I was thinking to myself, I'm like, why on earth? Would would Leo Laporte believe that Brian knows a damn thing about tech? You know, well it's you like, do, <laughs> you do. But, but there's no way for you to know that for me. Well, sticking you know who, nails you know who checked you or, out? Huh? Miss Colleen. Miss Colleen. Colleen. Miss Colleen said Brian is the man, and Colleen I. Colleen the Queen. She, if when she says it, I believe it. Well, so. good. I'm glad that I made the cut. Very cool. Are you going to come back and hypnotize me? Hypnotize <laughs> me? <laughs> sure. Why not? Do That's you do yours. hypnosis? Yes, uh, I've got a friend of mine who does. Uh, Can you bring a hypnosis in? Because I'm not hypnotizable. Yeah, I believe it. Uh, I, I don't think I am either. Yeah, see, every time I try to do that. In fact, I went to a, a hypnotherapist for a while, and he, he gave up on me. You know what really the hypnosis is? It's social pressure. If you have enough of a reason, like if there are enough, there are people where if there are people, 50 people in the audience, and they, all yeah. they, they won't be hypnotized. They're like, eh, 50 people, who cares? But if you're on a national television yeah. program, there's yeah. millions of people watching, and you are nervous, and you in your mind – it short circuits everything and says, I need to obey every single thing oh. this person tells me to do. Oh, that's interesting. And then, uh, it's, I it's, mean, a that's it's a protective uh, thing almost. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's very interesting. My son uh, got a stage, got hypnotized by a stage therapist, a stage hypno hypno hypnosis, hypnotist. hypnotist. Yeah. Not a hypnotherapist, but a hypnotist. Dance? Yeah, he did the whole thing, and then he ran away. Uh, the guy said something like, uh, oh, you're scared. There's a big lion. And, and Henry goes, ah! He's like 10 years old and literally runs off the stage, runs out of the fair. I mean, he keeps on going. Yeah. I mean, he kept going. They had to get a send a guy after him. It was like, wow, that worked. Yeah, I uh, I had a similar situation uh, where where somebody I, I we were in Vegas and uh, I had a little bit of the scam school juice and uh, they they drug me on stage for a for a stage hypnot hypnotist and uh, he was a friend of my friend who's the hypnotist C.J. Johnson. And uh, I felt like I was like, oh, I don't want to embarrass CJ. I'm going to be a good subject. I'm going to be a good subject. And I ended up being way too good a subject. It suddenly <laughs> became the Brian Brushwood Improv Hour. It was, it was terrible. Why, don't, why do I not have a hard time believing that? I've got, I've got <laughs> footage of it somewhere. <laughs> Brian, you're great. Thank you for coming by. I really Thank you so much it. for having me. This really was good to really have you. And, and a lot I, of fun. And, and a bunch of people didn't hear me say it earlier, but I've been a fan of uh, the screensavers since early on. And uh, uh, it was you guys that got me into tech TV. And that's how I got on to Martin Sargent's show, Unscrewed, and I taught Martin how to eat fire as a segment. And it was that link up that got renewed when I heard This Week, on te this week in Tech with and David you went Prater. To Revision 3. I went to them and pitched oh, Scam School, and so, so it all happened because oh, of this. Oh, that's so yeah. great. Well, I really appreciate it. Nice hey, to meet so you. Thanks so much, man. You come back. Please. Please, Happy anytime back. you're in town, you're coming back. I'd love to. And uh, everybody, we thank you for being here. I hope you enjoyed the, today's show. hope you enjoyed the wine tasting. I hope that wasn't too over the top. I think we had fun. Thanks to Roger and uh, thanks to Sarah Lane, and we'll see you next time. I'm gonna, we're gonna get going into reruns here, so I can party with these nice folks. We pulled off looking Ow! professional. Ow! Like a pro. Ow! You you like a rock star. Rock and roll. Rock and roll. That was really fun. What a great show. You had fun. I did. What are you doing?